Hi guys, it's Kayla Real, and welcome back to my channel. And no, I'm not wearing any makeup because this is a makeup video. So, woo! All right, pause right here just because you all have seen my foundation routine, so I'm not going to put it in there, so I'm just going to be going straight to my eyes, but all the makeup will be in the down bar below, so just check it out if you want to see that. So the first thing I'm going to be doing is priming my eyes, and I'm using the primer from my Hard Candy Look Pro Smoky Eyes eyeshadow palette, and this eyeshadow, just eyeshadow primer from Hard Candy. I really like this primer. It works really well, except the packaging is just weird. It's like this black mark on my mirror over here, and I was like doing my eyes, and I was like, oh! Alright, and then using my same uh, Smoky Eye palette, I'm just going to be taking the black. Ooh, don't fall, don't fall. I'm going to be using Chard right here on the outer corner of my eyeball. You're going to be cutting your eyeball in thirds. I'm going to be doing that same Chard. Um, that just sounds weird. I'm going to be going back in, but in the very, what is that called? I don't know. I always forget. The very inside of your eyeball, also coloring in only a third of it, leaving the very middle part with no eyeshadow on it. Weird. <laughs> don't worry, that's supposed to happen. Okay, if you have watched my videos a lot, you have seen this palette, and I still have no clue where I got it or where it came from, but I love this palette because it's huge and wonderful, and as you can see, I use it a lot. And I've actually had it for some time. is this weird, like, plum reddish shape right here, shape, color. We're just going to slightly take this on our brush, the same brush that I've been using before, and we're going to pat this into the crease where the black is. So blending this with the black and you can even put it just a little bit higher than your crease but be very careful because the black likes to follow it that is what I'm thinking of right now so I'm taking is my elf flawless eyeshadow palette oh, like this it's so dirty I'm so sorry in golden goddess and I'm going to be taking this color here. It's like a goldish brown color. I don't know if you can see that. Hopefully you can. I love this color. You'll, I use this color a lot in some of my fall things. And we're just going to be placing this in the middle of our eyelid. Elf eyeshadow palette again. And I'm going to be using this like clear champagne color here very bright very wonderful I'm placing this right underneath my eyebrows and any color that you are having that is a yellow white ish color I'm using this one right here use it in the inner corner of your eye inner corner I ever freaking remembered it <laughs> Hydrated. I'm just going to be adding any really chapstick. I'm using the Smooth and Shine uh, Essential Lip Balm. My L'Oreal Paris, the Super Slim Liquid Eyeliner, which I have been loving. It's such a great eyeliner, and especially if you don't know how to do cat eyes, like I didn't know how to do cat eyes and I couldn't do them really well. This eyeliner, I'm like looking down because I have stuff on me. This eyeliner just does it for you and just slides on and it's wonderful and I raved about it in like three other videos. So. Okay, I'm going to... Oh, well that's annoying. Just told me like it stopped recording, so hopefully I have everything. I just put this mascara on. Hopefully it was recording that whole thing. If not, I was using it, the Double Extended Beauty Tube Mascara. And I just used side one, so now I'm going to be using side two. Now I'm just looking at my face and I wanted to add a little bit more color. Yeah, I know. So I'm going to be using my Physician's Formula Blush in Rose. And as you can see, it's broken. ka -ching. I bought it and then I like opened it up and it totally just fell apart. And I couldn't bring it back because I don't know where I put the receipt. But oh well, it still works fine. I'm just gonna take a little bit, woo! 
press it on my cheeks. Smells so good. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be using the from now lending lasting finish uh, contouring pencil, a contouring pencil. I've used this a lot. It's really tiny and it's I need to sharpen it. But I'm just going to use this on the outside of our lips. Oh yeah. Woo! We're basically just splitting our face in thirds. Just basically. Okay. The next thing that I'm going to be placing in the middle of my lips is the exaggerated full color lip liner in the color natural. Oh yeah, this is in the color of Wild Clover. So then we're just placing natural in the middle of our lips. Now in general, you're going to put on a clear lip gloss, but because I cannot find mine anywhere, I'm going to be using the Mega Sticks Wet and Wild Lip Gloss. That's just like a pinkish lip gloss, but I'm just going to be placing this over it. That is your fall look, and if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up, and if you recreate it, please, please, please send me a picture to any of the links below. Also, if you want to hear or see more of me, all my links are below, so go follow me or subscribe if you haven't already, because that would be awesome. I hope that you guys are having a fabulous week and potting it up because you only live once. The reason I'm doing this quote is just because this makeup is a little bit out there, but that's okay because this is me and if you want to do it, that is you also. And it is you were born in an original, so don't die a copy. I love this quote, it's an amazing quote, and I love you Candy Johnson because you are just fabulous, and if you haven't already seen her, go check her out. Her links will be in the down description, in the down bar below. See you girls, bye!